glass. We use it for windows, we drink from it, we even use it to see ourselves. Glass is everywhere. But how is it made? And where is it made? Would you believe glass is in fact made from sand? And glass in many of the major construction projects across the Middle East and across the world is made in one particular location, Guardian Glass in Ras Al Khaimah. Whether it's the F1 Hotel on Yas Island, the address downtown, Dubai Frame, or even the UAE and Saudi pavilions at Expo 2020, the glass was made at an enormous 37,000 square metre production facility in Ras Al Khaimah, which is one of the region's most cost-effective manufacturing hubs. The team of over 200 staff at Guardian work day and night to ensure continued production. And it all starts with silica sand, which is mixed with recycled glass and various chemicals that are then melted in a huge furnace at about 1,650 degrees Celsius. And you thought it was hot outside. The materials then melt into a liquid that floats through a tin bath, which ensures a very straight and plain surface. The newly formed glass, as you can imagine, is still quite hot, so it is cooled slowly before going through various quality inspections and cutting, to be sold either as clear glass or with various high-tech coatings that help with protection from the sun or insulation from the cold, depending on where in the world the glass is being shipped. Guardian Glass is an internationally renowned US company that has found success in the region with the help of a strong working relationship with Ras Al Khaimah Economic Zone. From its state-of-the-art base in Alhamra Industrial Zone, Guardian produces glass for buildings, facades, interiors such as tabletops and furniture, as well as automotive glass and some other specialty applications. Here's the company's marketing director to tell us more. Guardian is one of the biggest uh, worldwide glass producer. We are having 26 factories worldwide. Uh, the, the company is headquartered in Michigan, uh, in a place called Open Hills. And uh, we started basically in 1935 as a small windshield uh, factory before uh, starting producing glass in early 70s, 1970s. So when it comes to Russell Kema, we, we started to uh, our operations here in 2007. We saw an opportunity uh, for us to serve better our customers. And uh, this is how we, uh, how we came here. So if I compare from 2007 to, to today, uh, there was a, a quite important uh, advancement of the Emirate of Ras Al Khaimah uh, in terms of infrastructure, in terms of modernization, digitalization. It's very, very easy and simple to do things in Ras Al Khaimah. And also, very importantly, uh, it's a place where we can attract uh, and keep talents, uh, which is extremely important. The uh, environment that Ras Al Khaimah is providing uh, it's, 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 it's amazing, uh, ranging from uh, work, education, family, leisure, uh, everything is there, infrastructure. Here it's very well connected with the rest of the world. We are pretty much in the middle of the world. And uh, yeah, I think uh, people should, uh, should not uh, hesitate too much uh, when coming to Russell Kema. As mentioned, Guardian has been involved in most of the major construction projects in the region, and since setting up in Ras Al Khaimah, it has produced eye-watering amounts of glass. Uh, since we started our operations here in 2007, uh, we have produced as much glass as to uh, cover uh, 50,000 football pitches. And when it comes to uh, high-performance glass, uh, the, the, the coated products, uh, well, everybody knows Burj Khalifa, which is made out of uh, our, our glass, uh, and, and I can say that approximately 140 to 150 uh, Burj Khalifas could have been glazed uh, with that amount of glass. And of course, Ras Al Khaimah has played his part in Guardian's regional success story. Well, the benefit uh, of being in Ras Al Khaimah is, uh, well, the first and foremost, we are close to our customers and uh, we are close to our suppliers um, as well. And uh, uh, definitely uh, Ras Al Khaimah uh, provides uh, an outstanding environment for uh, our company to prosper and to develop itself, um, including uh, all the opportunities that are given to our employees, uh, ranging from healthcare, schooling, leisure. And to, to, to say this, I would like to emphasize the proximity of the ports 
uh, here so that uh, another option is open to us uh, when, it, when we think about exporting our goods um, in other parts of the world. Now you can see clearly Guardian's work from Ras Al Khaimah reflected around the world. Thank you.